We're here with Assemblywoman Shavonda Sumter, uh, Coalition for a Better Patterson, yes. National Voter Registration Day. The importance, I mean, you, as a legislator, as one of the leadership, uh, part of the leadership in New Jersey legislation, this is not a local issue, this right. is a national issue is. for us to get out and vote. A message to our audience about the importance of getting out to vote and registering to vote. Sure. First off, you need to remember to take your souls to the polls. We all must engage. You and I wouldn't be in office if people weren't registered to vote and they voted. This is the third African-American male to serve in a 218-year history for the 35th district, which includes Patterson. I'm the second African-American female to serve in this capacity. So when you talk about historic reference and standing on the shoulders of giants, voting is your one way to do that. And I wear my United States lapel pin of the flag because we can make change happen if we vote. And we need everyone to register and take their souls to the polls. There you have it from our state assembly women of the 35th district representing right here. You know what? Let's get out and rock the vote and take your souls to the polls. <laughs> Dates. Last day to register. October two, 16th. Or, or, yep, 16th. Yes. Uh, voting day. Voting day is November 6th. Any other dates? And no other dates, but just make sure that if you vote, by mail, vote by mail. Vote by mail. Early vote. Early vote. We can, can you vote more than once? You can't vote, nah. you can't vote more than once, but I would appreciate yeah. if you did. <laughs> Listen, let's just make sure you get out and vote. October 16th is the deadline to register to yes. vote. We need to get that done today. 10 for 10. Get 10 people let's registered to vote. We can do this. Let's do it. Voting, if, uh, if choosing someone to represent you. Voting helps you become a stronger person because you're choosing who leads you. And if you don't pick your right leader, who will you become? And the reason we need a great leader is because we need great youth. We need great people representing us. So that's why I'm here to talk a little bit about that. And I just feel as though people not choosing to vote has affected this country very sadly. We have a leader of the We're at the Masonic Temple with Coalitions for a Better Community. Shelton Prescott, uh, the worshipful master, master here at the Masonic Temple. Um, just give us an overview of today, what it's about. I know this is not a one-day event. This is something that obviously is leading up to the November 6th election and beyond. Uh, well, the Coalition for Better Communities were established uh, back in June of this year. And um, basically, we took some of the great organizations in the city of Patterson and abroad that have some of the like-minded conditions that they want to resolve in the city of Patterson and abroad. Um, not only voter registration, but also crime, um, education, and, and so many other components that we started with uh, the first event, which was uh, National Night Out. And then after National Night Out, we had great feedback, so we decided to work on the National Voter Registration Day, which is today, September 25th. Um, this is not a one-shot deal, Coalition for Better Communities. Uh, we're going to continue to have sustained action on a lot of the issues and a lot of the concerns that permeate our city and uh, the surrounding areas of our city. So we're starting with voter, uh, the voter reg registration drive, which is taking place today nationally. And then we will follow up uh, the following weeks with some of our other projects that we're going to do collectively as several organizations. All right. And if, if there's one message when you talk about national voter registration, mm -hmm. the importance of this midterm election, mm -hmm. um, the importance and, and particularly for people of color to get out and, and, you know, really, you know, get that ballot, you know, stuff, get everybody out, mm -hmm. you know, children, grandchildren, whoever it may be. Right. Give me give one message to our viewing audience. Well, I think the number, number one thing is that our, our vote has power and it has purpose purpose. And I think when it comes to voting, we can look at six components. First off, we have to have voter education. We have to educate our people on the importance of voting. Then we have to register them through voter registration. Then after we register our voters, now we have to motivate them to, to vote in every election, whether it's at the federal, state, or municipal level. So we have to have voter motivation. And then after voter motivation, we have to organize them so they can do that consistently through sustained action, which is voter organization. And then we have to work collectively to get them to the polls through voter mobilization. And then prayerfully, if we have an abundance of people that consistently come out and vote, maybe we can have effective voter legislation that can help us in the future. Well, you know, Brother Prescott has said a lot, but I hope you 
you get a whole grasp. The bottom line is we need you to get out and rock the vote on November 6th and beyond. Be involved in the total process. So we're at the Masonic. We're going to visit with some of the other organizations uh, for a couple of minutes and move on. But do not forget the deadline for voter registration is Tuesday, October 16th. October 16th. And the, obviously the actual voting date is November 6th. But don't forget, you can early vote. Go to your county clerk. Go to your city clerk. Um, you could do, if you're out of town, you got college students. They can vote by mail. You got military. Vote by mail. Do what you have to do. People don't understand if you have a relative who may be incarcerated and they're only in the county jail, they can still vote. Let's make sure everybody gets out and votes. We're here with the Coalition for a Better Patterson and the NAACP and other members that are part of this group. We just want to talk about the importance of voting and why we need to get out and vote. Real quick, can you just give our viewing audience just some points on why they must vote? The reason why you must vote is because our ancestors, the people who came before us, shed literal blood, sweat, and tears to give us the right to be heard and seen in this country. How can you complain about what's happening in this country if you don't go to the polls to cast your vote and to have your voice heard. We have to be represented and that, as they say, all politics is local. Any messages for us? Yes, in order to have a change, we must vote. A lot of people complain about what's going on in the city, what's going on in America, but we have the power to change that and that's in our vote. Anybody else? It's really important to get out and vote because your voice can be heard. It's a way of showing that, you know, you do want to stand up for your rights. You want to get the right people in at the right time and at the right places so that we can represent each other and not have someone make our choices for us. That's a great point. Would you like to say something? Great. Please go out and vote. We need your vote, each and every one of you. You're here. You have to say something now. It's your right to vote. You make a difference. If you do not vote, other people have control of what you want to say. So go out and vote. There you have it. Some great people, some great ladies saying, get out and vote. It's for our rights. You're talking about women's health care, early childhood education, fully funding our education systems, fair and affordable housing, public safety, all comes down to the vote. So let's make sure we get out and rock the vote. Rock the vote. No, thank you. This young man here, the, um, the importance of voting, you know, I know you represent many organizations, but as a law enforcement officer and the reasons why we need to vote, this a quick message to the viewing audience. Well, absolutely. If voting is important, and it's important to understand that local politics is national politics. You have the right to vote, no matter who you decide to vote for, show up and cast your vote. Understand that you have some power, because if I decide to stay home and you decide to stay home, the other person wins. So we have to show up, cast our vote, and be counted. And we're important. One message to the viewing audience about the importance of voting. If you vote, you make a choice. And if you don't vote, you still make a choice. That's a great point. And one of our few recent college graduates, as a millennial and being involved, and I know you are, how important is it for us to get those young folks out here and vote? It's super important, you know, as a as a, a young person, you know, just coming up and getting jobs, you know, we're starting to pay taxes and all those things, but also, um, like Judith said, when you don't vote, you're essentially already voting to not have a voice. So your vote is your voice. One message to the young folks? Get out and vote. Rock the, can we rock the vote? Yes. Come on rock over here, my assembly mate, Javonna Sumter.